Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing today? I hope everyone is okay. I'm fine, thank you. For those of you that are new here, my name is IG Serio and I share spiritual tips that helps us to succeed, that helps us to grow our spiritual life, that drives away negative energy and that attracts luck, open heaven, open doors, blessings, breakthroughs, using natural things. All the tips I share in this channel is all about natural things. The natural things that you can find in your surrounding, your kitchen, just natural things around you that is easy to get. So, if you like that, do consider subscribing. Turn on your notification bell so that you'll be notified each time I upload videos. Like my videos, watch them to the end, and comment. Drop your comments in the comment section. Thank you. So, for today, just like the topic, if you want your loved one to do whatever you want them to do, you ask of them without any excuse. Or even to do something for you without even you having to ask then you'll be needing three items for that for this exercise you'll be needing three items you'll be needing your tomato your piece of paper and your pen and please for you to do this exercise you must make sure that you love the person with all your heart and then you're not going to request for something evil from the person or something that is going to harm the person. You just maybe your relationship is not going the way you want it to be and you need to talk to your partner. You need to plead with your partner to treat you right or to help you one way or the other. Or you need something from your partner. Or you need your partner to stop looking elsewhere and focus just on you and your relationship with him or her. Or, I don't know, whatever you need from your partner, whatever you need from your lover, your soulmate, that is not evil or harmful, then I will teach you, I will show you this exercise. You try it, it works. So, just like I said, you'll be needing tomato just like this. Just like this. You'll be needing tomato like this. And when you get your tomato, you get a plate or a bowl or anything and then you squeeze out the juice of the tomato. Tomato has a lot of spiritual benefits. There is a, you, you can use tomato for a lot of things. But for today, I will, I will show you how to use it to demand something from your partner and he or she will do it without any excuse. Would do as you said. So just um, get your tomato, cut it into two like this, and then bring a bowl or a flat plate, whatever that you can squeeze the juice of the tomato inside. Then you squeeze the juice of the tomato, you squeeze out the juice of the tomato inside the bowl. And while squeezing the juice, please make sure that the seeds, this seeds you're seeing here, the seeds will enter the juice. The, 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 the juice you're squeezing out, make sure the seeds enter inside. And when you squeeze out the juice of the tomato, you get your uh, piece of paper, a blank one that nothing is written on it, a plain piece of paper and your pen, and then you write your partner's name seven times on it. Write your partner's name seven times on the piece of paper and then place it into the tomato juice, wet, wet it with the tomato juice and make sure the seeds of this tomato are on the piece of paper. Then you let it dry. You let the piece of paper dry. You keep outside for it to dry. So after drying the piece of paper, you burn it. You can use your matches you can use your matchstick, you can use your lighter, you can go to your burner, your cooker, and burn it there, wherever, 
wherever you want to bend it, just bend it. Make sure you're bending it with the seed. Because if, as you wet the piece of paper with the tomato juice and then the seed inside, the seed, when it dries, the seed should be on the piece of paper. The seeds of the tomato should be on the piece of paper. So when you're burning it, you're burning the piece of paper with the seeds in on it. With the tomato seeds on the paper. So you're going to burn it as it's burning. As the paper is burning, you start praying. You call the name of your partner. And then whatever it is you want to ask the person, you start praying. You tell God that if it's a partner that been cheating on you, that... As you do this exercise, he or she will not even remember to hurt you anymore. Just keep praying, whatever you want to ask of your partner. You tell God that as you're doing this exercise, once you open your mouth and ask of your partner, whatever you ask of him or her, that he or she will do it. Or that he or she will remember to help you without even you asking. You just pray. You know what exactly you have in your heart before you do this exercise. So just pray about it. Pray to God with it, about it. With your faith and belief, it will work for you. Once you believe it's going to work, it will definitely work for you. All you need is your faith and your belief and it will work. I remember there is nothing fetish with this. It is not fetish. You're praying to God using just tomato. You even eat tomato, so it's not fetish. And there are no side effects. You're not using it to harm the person. So that is why I said, before I started explaining, I said, if you before you do this, make sure you really love the person and then whatever you're going to ask for is not going to be harmful to that person. So as long as you're not asking for anything harmful from the person, there are no consequences, there are no side effects. It's just for your own benefit. And you're praying to God about it. And with your faith and belief that as it's working for other people, that it's going to work for you, then it will definitely work for you. For those of you that are seeing your messes, for the ladies that are menstruating, please don't do this. Wait until you stop menstruating, then you can do it. Once you're menstruating, or even if you're in the process of doing this, and then your menstruation starts, please stop. And then start after you finish menstruating. You don't need to do this when you're menstruating. And you can, there is no time frame for this one. You can do it either in the morning, in the afternoon, or in the night. And if you want to do it for three days, you can do it for three days. If you want to do this for seven days for fast results, you can do it for seven days for fast results and you see the person change. And whatever you open your mouth to ask of your partner, he or she will just do it without even blinking. Without even questioning why, they will just do whatever you ask of them. As long as it's for good. Why don't you give it a try? Eh? With faith and belief, it will definitely work. So like I said, there are no time frame. It can be done in the morning, afternoon or night. And you can do this for either three days or seven days. If you need a faster result, do it for seven days. If you can't do it for seven days and you just want to do it for three days, then you can also do it for three days. So that is all for today. I hope this video has been helpful. Please remember to subscribe. Remember to turn on your notification when you do subscribe so that you'll be notified each time I upload videos. Like my videos share, comment, whatever it is you want to talk to me about, your testimonies, your suggestion, and whatever. If you're going through any problem and you need to talk to me, you can drop it in this comment section. I will sure to read it and reply. I'll see you in my next video, but until then, remain blessed. Bye.